if you have a sensitive skin do a patch test hi guys welcome to my channel if it's your first time here hi my name is Messi. welcome to my channel so in today's video i'll be reviewing um, the dudu ocean bar soap i'll be giving my honest review on this bar this particular bar soap it's a very good bar soap but it has some benefits and some not so good benefits so if you're interested to hear my honest review please keep on watching So first of all, I'll be reading out the ingredients in this bar soap. So this bar soap has palm kernel oil, cocoa pod ash, palm bunch ash, shea butter, lime juice, honey, olive aloe vera, palm wood powder, perfume, lemon juice. And that's the ingredient in this particular bar soap. So, so I will be sharing with you the benefits of this bar soap. First of all, it's a very good bar soap for the face and for your body. For dark skin, light skin, any skin tone, it's a very good bar soap. Uh, in my video where I recommended bar soaps for dark skin, this is one of the bar soaps I recommended for dark skin. It's a very good bar soap. It lightly exfoliates and gives your skin a healthy glow, no doubt about this bar soap. I can attest to the fact that it evens out dark spots. I can't really say for eczema, but most will give reviews for eczema. I've not tried I don't have eczema on my skin, so I can't say if it's really clears eczema so these are like the benefits i have noticed for myself it's a very good bar so definitely exfoliate your skin and gives you a very good glow the part that is that is not really advisable when it comes to using this soap is because of the active ingredients that this soap has this is not the soap you leave on your skin for a long period of time this is not the soap you apply on your face directly i would not recommend this at all applying on your face directly or leaving it on your skin the skin on your face is more fragile to the back of the rest of your body the other part of your body can even stand it when you apply it on the skin but don't apply it on your face at all not recommended to apply on your face instead you wet your hand and then rub it around the soap then whatever you have on your hand you apply on your face that is the um, best way I would advise anyone to use this soap and then you can get this to be in a liquid form it is less harsh when you get this to be in a liquid form um, how do you get this to be in a liquid form you soak this in a hot water and leave it overnight that's how you get this to a liquid um, black soap if this is too harsh for your skin and another thing is if you have a sensitive skin do a patch test do a patch test on any part of your skin to know how your skin will react that is one thing i would advise anyone that has um sensitive skin this is a very good vessel for all skin type and all skin tone but if you have a sensitive skin please do a patch test and make sure you do a patch test i don't have a sensitive skin but just to see how your skin will react to this soap please do a patch test this soap will leave your skin so dry so you need moisturizer the fact that it dries it out your skin is not that bad so what you just need to complement it is to get a moisturizer after taking your bath with this soap please moisturize your skin immediately even if you have oily skin you have combination skin you have dry skin please moisturize your skin immediately after using this particular bath soap to bath moisturize your skin immediately one of the ingredients i mentioned in this bath soap is lemon juice and lime you use this soap don't go out in the sun without your sunscreen. It will darken me. That's why most people say this ocean darkens me. This ocean is for dark people alone. I believe that this soap is for all skin tone, but it is when you now go out under the sun without sunscreen that is when it will burn your skin. So if you're using this particular body scrub, moisturizer and sunscreen should be your best friend. Moisturizer and sunscreen should be your best friend. I'm saying it again. For those of you that will say it darkens you, it's because you don't use a sunscreen. And because of the lime and lemon juice in it, going under the sun, it will get some bone or to darken you and to darken you rather. So get yourself a sunscreen. So lastly, I will recommend you use this for your nighttime shower routine instead of daytime. You can use it in the day, during the day as well, but I just recommend it for nighttime shower routine. So overall, I would say this is a very good 
um, bar soap. This video was not sponsored by Douche, by the way. This is just like my honest review. It cleanses your skin very well, gives you that healthy glow, even out dark spots, uh, ratchets. Some people say eczema as well. So, this is a very good bar soap. I recommend just that when you're using this, please your moisturizer and your sunscreen should be your best friend apart from the fact that it dries out your skin and then the other things i mentioned is a very good bar so just know how to use it and use it well that's it basically thank you so much for watching this is my honest review on this bar so i hope i was able to answer your question concerning this particular bar so please don't forget to like share and subscribe and i will see you in my next video thank you so much for watching bye for now